echocardiographic profile in prosthetic mitral valve. Usually we start imaging from the parasternal long axis view which is called plaques in short form. In this view we can see the outflow region of the right ventricle and basal part of the left ventricle with intraventricular septum in between. Left ventricular outflow tract above the mitral valve can be seen leading to the aorta. Left atrium is seen posterior to the aorta. The prosthetic mitral valve disc is seen in a horizontal position here with significant echo density of the metallic component. Acoustic shadowing is seen posterior to the dense disc shadow which extends up to the posterior wall of the left atrium proximal to the mitral annulus. Because of the acoustic shadowing, it will be difficult to recognize any structure in that region like a vegetation or a thrombus. Please subscribe to this channel for future updates. Click on the subscribe button. Press the bell icon after that for all updates. With the tilting disc of the prosthetic mitral valve in close position in the systolic frame, there is no color flow across the mitral valve. At the same time, red colored flow is seen anterior to the mitral valve in the left ventricular outflow tract and into the aorta. In the diastolic frame, a good gap is seen between the disc and anterior mitral annulus region in the left panel. Right panel shows excellent color flow across the prosthetic mitral wall with mild turbulence which is usual across a prosthetic wall. Flow is seen from the left atrium to the left ventricle in an andro-epical direction. A pical four-chamber view shows the prosthetic mitral wall with dense acoustic shadowing proximal to it in the left atrium. This apical four-chamber view with prosthetic mitral disc in the close position in systole is seen in the left panel and color Doppler image in the right panel shows no flow across the mitral wall. The blue color in the left ventricle is the left ventricular outflow which is away from the apical transducer and hence coded blue. Acoustic shadowing proximal to the prosthetic mitral wall in the left atrium is seen quite prominently. A pical four chamber image with the tilting disc of the prosthetic mitral valve in a partially open position. Short area of echo lucency to the right side of the disc is seen. Split screen image from the pical four chamber view with left panel showing the disc in open position and right panel showing the flow across the prosthetic mitral valve on color Doppler. Continuous wave Doppler interrogation across the prosthetic metal wall showing the transmitral gradient with peak of 6 mm of mercury and mean of 3 mm of mercury which are within normal limits. Please note the dense vertical shadows on either side of mitral Doppler tracing which is the artifact due to the prosthetic wall opening and closing. Please don't forget to subscribe to this channel for future updates and click on the bell icon for all updates. Thank you.